In order to reduce post-harvest losses in the country, especially the Upper West Region, seven warehouses are being constructed there. The need for warehouses came to the fore following the implementation of government's flagship program, which was spiraled, the has spiraled the production of farm produce in the region. Tony's Upper West correspondent, Rafiq Salam, report from Bulenge. Lack of storage facilities for the agriculture sector to preserve farm produce and eliminate post service losses has been a ritual nightmare for decades. The canker has rendered many farmers in the country less productive and sometimes threatens food security in the country and also reduces its export. In the Upper West region, however, agricultural production has more than doubled due to the introduction of the government flagship program planting for food and jobs in 2017. Total land area cultivated in 2018 alone has increased from 21,133 to 98,291 hectares, translating into an increase of 268 metric tons from 45,648 to 314,553 in 2018. Silos and receptacles are used by the farmers in order to preserve their farm produce. However, these obsolete ways of preserving the farm produce is unable to contain the several thousands of metric tons cultivated. Government under the Planting for Food and Jobs program is therefore providing seven warehouses in the Upper West region with a storage capacity of 1,000 metric tons each. One of such sites is located at Bulingi in the Wa'is district. Construction of the warehouse was awarded to Sambex Limited last August and expected to be completed in February 2019. The project is, however, behind schedule owing to some constructional challenges. 45% of work has so far been executed. Engineer Asadi Nanjo is the project site supervisor. The contractor is claiming that since we prepared payment certificate for them. Mm. I think they've only received payment just last week. Okay. So that is why we've even resumed. We resumed about a week ago. Mm. We are going to put pressure on the contractor to Good. live up to at least if we cannot finish by February, but it should not exceed much. Upper West Regional Minister Alhaji Suleiman Al Hassan expressed satisfaction when he inspected progress of work at the site. We are impressed with what you have done so far, well, what will urge and that if you can quicken the pace a bit. And you claim you were not paid, now that you have been advanced something, I think if you add that to your own resources, you can make up an impact of the project. The minister also made similar visits to two private warehouses belonging to an agribusiness giant and the 2013 second runners of National Best Farmer, Al Haji Antiko Abdullahi. Now we are tripling the production figures. Last year, I think we, only, we were able to fill only two warehouses. This year, four big warehouses are full up of uh, meat, seed, and green. So uh, one of our demand will be warehousing. If, um, Government can support the private sector like Antigua Company to get bigger warehouses at vintage points so that it will help seed production. Alaji Suleiman Al Hassan assured him and other private companies working in the field of agriculture of the support of the government. Reporting for J News, Rafik Salam, Bullying.